Yes, take rough sheet and we'll start drawing circles. A big circle. Okay, we'll go very slow. We'll start drawing big circle. We'll draw up to 10 circles. We'll draw 10 clockwise and 10 anti-clockwise. Make sure that your palm is not touching the sheet. Yes, everyone take your rough sheet and start drawing circles. Okay. And in opposite direction. We'll make some circles. So that we can improve our shapes. These are very basics in drawing. Okay. Yes, now we'll practice some sleeping lines. Horizontal lines, okay. From left to right corners. Straight sleeping lines. We'll draw 10 sleeping lines. Yes, I want everyone to do their work. This is a practice session. So everyone draw up to 10 sleeping lines from left to right. And then later from right to left. Once again, sleeping lines from right to left. From right to left. Yes, this is a practice session or warm-up session. And then we'll draw some vertical lines from top to bottom. Straight line. From top to bottom. Okay. And then later from bottom to top. Once again vertical lines. From bottom to top. Okay, and then now we'll make some diagonal lines. Okay, how to draw diagonal lines? Yes, we'll draw some diagonal lines. From bottom left to top right corner. And same way in the opposite direction. Mm -hmm. 
in today's class these lines are very important okay yes next we'll practice some rectangles we'll draw some small rectangles okay we'll practice some rectangle we'll practice some rectangles and then triangles there are three angles that's why it's called triangle yes these are the basic shapes for drawing yes now everyone keep your sheets aside we'll meditate for 30 seconds okay everyone close your eyes now keep everything aside now you need to meditate for 30 seconds okay everyone close your eyes start counting from 1 to 30 very good close your eyes very nice everyone are closing their eyes very good yes 20 more seconds Yes, very nice, very good. Ten more seconds. Yes, very nice. Now slowly rub your palms and touch your eyes. Yes. Hello all good evening Yes today we are making cartoon right Yes so in cartoon will be using very basic shapes and it will be very easy and also we are making shark in a cartoon manner and also later we'll be doing folding surprise puppet okay we'll do it later so first take your drawing sheet okay keep in vertical manner are you ready shall we start the class first you need to take drawing sheet and keep pencil aside okay yes now look at the screen so we will take top edge of the paper and fold it down to the bottom okay now we'll take top edge of the paper and fold it down to the bottom line it up with the edge okay we'll line up with the edge and we'll press here so what did we do now we need to take top edge of the paper and fold it down to the bottom line and we'll fold like this okay and then we'll take top flap and we'll fold it back to the top like this top edge
so you got like this right and once again now look at the screen we'll flip it okay we'll flip it and do the same procedure okay will fold back to the top i'll repeat it once again from the start okay yes this is what what we get okay now i'll start from the start so this is your drawing sheet now we'll take top edge of the paper and fold it down okay and then we gonna take top flap and we'll fold back to the top we'll fold back to the top like this okay now press carefully and then we'll flip the sheet we'll flip the sheet and once again we'll fold back to the top okay yes now you got like this right so you need to fold like this and fold it in this manner okay did you all get that yes we'll keep the sheet like this yes here are two foldings and here there is no folding so we'll keep the sheet in this manner so we'll start drawing now did everyone get till here any doubts Yes, if you have any doubts, then thumbs up. Yes, then shall we proceed? Yes. Okay, fine. Now, take your pencil. Yes, uh, somebody is asking me to repeat. So, I'll repeat for one more time. So this is your sheet. This is your drawing sheet. And we will take the top edge of the paper and fold it down to the bottom. Okay. We'll fold it down to the bottom. And then with the edge here, okay. We'll top. We're going to take top flap and we will fold back to the top like this. We'll fold it to the top. And we'll flip the paper. Once again, we'll fold it to the top. Okay, very simple. And then we will flip again. So we got here, we got two foldings here. Yes. Then we'll start drawing. Okay, now take your sketch pen. If you want, you can take pencil and draw the outline by using pencil. Or if you are well versed in shapes, you can go directly with black sketch pen. Okay, we have practiced yesterday as well the basic shapes, half circles, semicircles, or circles, triangles, right? Even today. So, try to do by using sketch pen directly. Okay? If you are very small, then go with pencil. So, first, take your sketch pen and we'll make half circle. So, here are two foldings. From here, from this part, you need to make half circle. So we'll make half circle. So 
so we we made half circle okay and even in this portion we need to make same thing we need to make half circle Okay, we have made the whole circle now. Okay, did you all get that? Yes. Once again, I'll repeat from the start. Okay, this is your drawing sheet, and you need to take top edge to the bottom and fold it down like this, and we'll take top flap and we'll fold it back to the top once again flip the sheet and once again to the top okay and then we have once again flipped and we have made two half circles which becomes a small circle shall we proceed Yes, now we'll make two eyes. Okay, we'll make two small circles. One and two. Okay, we have made two small circles. And once again, we have to make two small circles on the right top. Like this. Two small circles. Okay, and then now we'll shade here by using black sketch. If you don't have black sketch, then use black gel pen. Yes. Okay, and then we'll make two nostrils. One and two. Okay, we'll wait for some time. Yes, we have made two semicircles, which becomes a big circle. And then we have made two eyes, 
by using circle and two small dots which indicates nostrils. Yes, next we'll draw two fins, okay? Here is a half circle. So we'll draw two fins, which is nothing but curve V, okay? So here we'll make curved V like this on both the sides, even in the right hand side. We'll make curved V. Okay, and on the top we'll make one more fin, just V. It's very simple. We are using basic shapes, and in today's class, everyone's artwork must be very neat. Because these are the basic shapes and try to do as neat as possible. Yes. Shall we proceed? Yes. Now we'll open this. Okay. We'll open this and... We need to make straight line here. We need to join these two lines. So you should not use scale. I don't want anyone to use scale. We'll draw free handed. Okay. We'll draw free handed. So we practice straight lines. Right. So we'll use that here. We'll make straight line. I don't want anyone to use scale or any tools, okay? We'll draw free-handed. Okay, and here is the folding you can see, right? We can see a folding here. So, we'll make straight line. Just draw the folding. You should not touch to the corner, okay? Just a straight line without touching the end. Okay, and here you can see one more folding here, right? You can see folding here and this time you, need, you should not make straight line there, but slide at the top, okay? You must leave some gap and make a straight sleeping line. This time, not on the folding. 
make sure that it is not on the folding. But at the top, we have made a straight sleeping line on the folding. Yes, we'll wait for two minutes. Yes. Okay. Now we'll join this line. Once again, by using straight line, we'll join these two lines. Okay. Once again, you should not use any tools like scales or anything. Okay. So we, it's like rectangle. Yes. Now we'll make sharp teeth, okay? So we'll make some random zigzag lines here at the top, okay? We'll make some random zigzag lines. Again, it must be very neat. Your hands may shiver, but try to control and make straight line, straight diagonal line. Okay, and then at the bottom, slightly curved V, okay? And also, it must be bigger than the top one. Slight bigger and also curved V like this. Not too much big, but slight bigger. And also slightly curved. Okay, and next we'll make tongue. Okay, so here is a folding you can see, right? 
Okay, here is a folding. And you need to make U here. Okay, U. You need to write U. Like this. Okay, we'll make a bit darker. This is the tongue we are doing now. You need to write you down to the teeth. And we'll join this by making two bumps. Okay. So here is a folding and you need to make two bumps like this. Okay. Yes, now we'll make throat. So at the top, okay, leave some gap here. Okay, we'll write small u. We'll write small u. Okay, we'll write small u now. Leave some gap and write u.
Yes, I hope everyone got till here. Yes. Shall we proceed or wait? Okay, we'll proceed now. Yes. Once again, take your sketch pen and we'll make some fissures over here. Okay. So it's very simple. You can use your creativity now. You can make water or anything you want. Okay. So I'll make fish, small fishes here. And here I, I, I want to see your creativity. I need everyone to do something apart from what I'm doing. So here I make some bubbles. I'll be making very small fishes. I'll give five minutes and you need to make something you want. That may be water or any kind of fishes. Think of ocean and do whatever you want. We'll wait for five minutes and we'll start coloring. We'll make some bubbles here and there. Yes, we'll wait for three minutes. I'll give you three minutes and I want to see your creativity now. You can make some creepers. Or frogs. Any kind of creatures you like, algae, I'll give you two minutes, last two minutes. If completed, you can show it to the camera. Arna, very creative, very good. Sadika, very nice.
view na nice. Rahin Sheikh, creative. Yes, last one more minute and we'll start coloring. So when we close, you know, it, it looks like puppet. We can make puppet show as well. See like this. After coloring, you will get to know. Now everyone keep ready with oil pastels. I will look into your works later. So shark will be grain color, right? Okay, we'll proceed now. So everyone, close your sheet like this. Okay. We'll give gray color to this part. Okay. Only for the top semicircle, not at the bottom, only at the top. So we'll give gray color and for this thing we can give gray color. And not this part, okay? Let it be white. So we'll give gray. If you want, you can use paint or any other techniques you have learned before. You can make some shadings as well. I'll be using very simple technique. We have colored the fins and we'll color the head region. Again, I want to see your creativity here. You have learned many text techniques, right? So you can use that. So we'll give gray color to this shark. You can also use paint.
will make it neater. Yes, we have made it. We'll wait for some time, okay? Yes, next we'll open this. So we'll give red. Now take black sketch pen. Okay. Now take black sketch pen. And here is a part, right? You can give, you can shade it by using black. You can use a sketch pen or oil pastels. We'll shade the whole blank space. Okay, next we'll take light pink to shade here. Okay, shade the tongue. Pink tongue. Color very neatly, okay? Make sure that it is not going out of the border. Today's work, it must be very neat. Because these are the very basic shapes. So next rest part, we can give red color. Let it be 
teeth as it is but rest you need to color by using red okay we'll color the whole thing by using red You have learned many shading techniques. You can apply that as well. We'll make it neater. will color rest blank space let the teeth be as it is okay these are the white teeth of shark let it be as it is Yes, we'll color the whole thing. You can also paint. We'll go slow. Here you must be careful. Neatly make a line here like this. Okay, because it, it must it should not go to the teeth. Yes, this is the shark's mouth. We'll make it darker, a slight darker. So we can make a small line here.
and we can give blue for the bubbles outside so i don't know what you have made creative work so i'll be looking into that if you made ocean blue or you can give blue you can give yellow or orange for fishes so i'll give yellow lemon yellow so we'll give yellow for fins as well so there are four yellow fishes in my artwork so now name the shapes which we use today put on chat box you can direct message me which are the shapes we learn today see this is a folding surprise puppet see when you fold it and you can make puppet show see the shark speaking like this it's good right you can scare your sisters or brothers yes very good we learn semicircles rectangles triangle very good and then we learn how to color right yes that's about today's class i hope you enjoyed the class now i want to see your creativity so if you are completed bring it to the camera yes ziona explain me what you did ma'am i did some flowers and some fish and and some bubbles and some sun nice nice why sun because the the 
the the fishes here the fishes look it is uh, see the sun okay it's very big yes creative very good very good did you enjoy the class yes ma'am okay bye bye so it looks like this when you fold and you can when you open it looks like this you can make a small puppet show in your home today tell your parents to sit in front in front of you Okay, Sneha. Mom, I did the wow. What is that? The coral leaves, Mom. Nice, nice. Very good. And then inside there's a fish here. Yes. And there's a jellyfish here. Wow, nice jellyfish. Very good. Thank you, ma'am. Yes. Bye, ma'am. Bye. In today's class, we learn very simple and basic shapes. Yes, Rahim Sheikh. Hi, ma'am. Hi. Ma'am, uh, ma'am, actually, I co colored the whole shark, and here I have did some red on purpose because uh, when sharks eat, uh, they actually don't wipe the blood. Like us means if there is something stuck on our face, we cannot see that. So that's why I did that red color. And here mm -hmm. there is a ship passing through a head on the top. Very good. Nice. Okay. Bye, ma'am. So what did you learn in today's class? Ma'am, I learned. Uh, ma'am, actually, I learned uh, how to use different techniques in one uh, uh, one work, and how can shapes be useful to make one whole art? Yes. Very good. Bye, ma'am. Bye. Yes, Shri Harsh. See this man? Hi. Yes, what is that? Can you explain me? Fish. Okay, and then uh, and then this small shark. Yes. Okay. What, what kind of shapes did you learn today? I I I learned to shade like this. Yes. And shape. You learn semicircles, right? I, right. I learned draw rectangles. Triangles, right? Right, ma'am. Yes, very good. Very good. Keep up the good work. Bye. Bye. Avni Sakpal. Sorry, Anvi Sakpal. Hi. Hi. Yes, show me your work, dear. Very nice. And open that. 
Oh, scary. Yes, what is that? Can you explain me? I have done uh, some shells yes. and watered down. I have colored different colors for the fish. Wow, great. You practice at the start, right? Some shapes. Did it help you? Yes. Drawing this? Yes, that's why it is very helpful, right? Yes. yes. Okay, bye. Bye. Yes, Jigisha. Hello, ma'am. Hi. Wow, it's colorful. Yes, can you explain me? Oh, scary. Yes. So one day one shark was there. He was going out for his hunting. He was a cute shark. But some fishes tried to tease him. So he ate wow. some of the fishes. So creative. You made a story. Wonderful. Yes. Yes. Very nice. It Thank might be very easy for you. Because. Yes, miss. Yes. Okay. Miss, last time we had been also taught by another miss the same technique for Halloween. Is it? Yes. Okay. A witch was made. No, I was not know that. Bye, miss. Yes, bye. Yes, next, Viba. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, this is. Ma'am, I added some uh, sea waves, some rocks, and some coral, ma'am. Oh, that's really neat. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, only one mistake that I didn't. I made this thingy too long. Yeah, no problem. You understood the mistake. That's great, actually. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Ma'am, yeah. I added some bubbles and few fishes. And yes. all. Nice. And I made the teeth of it yellow because it uh, sharks, you know, won't brush their teeth, right? <laughs> yes. Okay. Very yes, nice. Yes. Thank you, ma'am. Yes. You're welcome. Bye. Ma'am, uh, this class is also very nice. I learned how to make this pop up like this, ma'am. Yes. Very nice. Very good. You made okay, it. Okay, Yes. Bye. Bye, ma'am. Yes, Sadika. Hi, ma'am. Hi. Wow, blue fish. Wonderful. Yes, nice. Starfishes. Okay, explain me what is that? I made some plants and some fishes and some stuff. Oh, nice. Okay, you made some plants, right? Yes. Did you enjoy the class today? Yes, ma'am. Yes, did you learn, learn the shapes? Yes, ma'am. Yes, okay. Thank Bye. you, ma'am. Yes, you are welcome. Bye. Yes, Deeksha. Uh, yes, ma'am. I decided to keep it kind of simple. And I was um, drawn some fishes and some seaweed and a few rocks. And I also drawn some blood stain on its teeth, which indicates that it already has eaten some fish. Nice, nice, creative, very good. Yes, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. This class was really nice and fun. Yes. You're welcome. Thank you. Bye, ma'am. Bye. Yes, raise your hand so that I can ask to unmute. Yes, Sana. Ma'am. Ma Hi, ma'am. Ma Can you explain me? 
Yes, nice. Very good. Thank you, ma'am. Happy Diwali. Thank you. Wish you the same. Bye. Bye, ma'am. Yes. Jita, Archana, Shreshta, Kriti. Can you show me your works? Yes, that's about today's class. I think uh, uh, Aditi, we should be able to end the classes then. Yes, sir. Okay, everybody, wish you all a happy De Deepavali. And we shall meet you guys tomorrow at 6.30. Okay. Bye-bye, everyone. Yes, bye.